So, for example, if you went out for a meal and the restaurant was deadly quiet, would you not be a bit freaked out by that? supposed to be vegan but I'm not unfortunately. Um, I actually found that being vegan, one of the problems with it was that I got B12 deficiency fairly fast. I usually eat breakfast quite late because um, then I can give myself the illusion that I've achieved a lot before breakfast and also it means I only have two meals a day. I'm currently on my way into town planning a big science in my head. I think I'm going to do xerophytes, halophytes, they can each make up one of those. Uh, and I'll carry on with the uh, Kirkwall Gaps thing and the ring system. On the 15th of September 1983 I had a premonition that I was going to die in this toilet on the 19th of December 1994 but it never happened. I'm on my way back from town now and I'm going to get on with the panel. I bought this while I was in town. Um, I don't buy clothes very often, I don't buy new clothes very often. Uh, and obviously this is a bit pandering to fashion but then of course anti-conformity is about as bad as conformity in a way. Um, I don't know because I'm too self-conscious to try clothes on before I buy them. Uh, but yeah, it seems to work okay. This is part of the notes I'm making for the halophyte xerophyte thing. I think I might include other plants as well. Uh, people are actually coming to the science today apparently, or at least one person is. So that's a, that's a plus. Right, I've had more confirmation that people are coming to the science, which is good. Um, just uh, going to have a glass of water because um, <clears throat> one of the advantages, unfortunately, of being addicted to caffeine is that you keep drinking. Whereas if you're not addicted to caffeine, which I am no longer, you just have to keep reminding yourself to drink. Now dispensing uh, 128 grams of Roman chamomile, um, which apparently is much less dense than uh, German chamomile. Let's look at the camera. Must look. Must look. Right, I'll set the camera. 14 seconds, okay. That'll do it. So, what does that mean? <laughs> okay, what's it doing? Speed wise. Speed wise. It's slowing down. Slowing down the further away it gets from the sun. What's, um, what's distinctive about cacti? They've got spines, haven't they? Okay, so those spines are actually leaves, yeah? Sure. Yeah. How are they different from ordinary leaves? They're spiky. What have you learned today, Alex? What have I learned today? I have learned about plants. Yep, yeah, tell me about plants. Deserts. Yep. Yeah. And in sea. Yep. Yeah. Fluey thing you had. Fluey thing you had. It's just, it's just streaming yellow gunk. Mm. Well, I've got something at the moment as well, actually. Oh, you said you felt sick yesterday. Mm, I didn't feel sick. It's because I do the science on the Monday, I usually try and cook something quick uh, and I'm afraid that's going to be veggie sausages and oven chips. Well, we normally eat like this, we do on Mondays because we don't have time because of the science sessions. Having been to the shop now because I'm able to finish buying the ingredients for the uh, tomorrow's dinner, um, so now I'm walking back and of course it's dark because we live in the North, Northern Hemisphere and it's winter. I some very carefully for radio. I realise that I'm cheating by a couple of minutes and it's actually only 18 minutes past six. I'm not sure what else is going to happen because basically I'm collapsed on the sofa and I'm not doing very much. What did I learn today? I suppose I learned that you shouldn't keep trying to edit the same file over and again because it goes all milky. Like I said, I'm not sure. I mean, I have got a cold today, so it could be that I'm just being a bit sore. Yeah. Also, I woke up very late, so there you go. I'm just going to introduce you to the rest of the family. This is Holly. Hello. This is Liz. I confess. Apparently she doesn't speak. Bye. Doctors are very the worst patients. This is time and echinacea. It should be diluted, but it isn't. Oh. And also, they've dribbled over everything, and it's 45% alcohol. A few thoughts about tomorrow. I'm going to be having a patient at 10.30, and then I'll probably be doing something about volume and measurement and units. It just occurred to me that if I keep going, I will end up producing more than four minutes, and this video is supposed to be called Four Minute Monday. The answer is, of course, to call it Five Minute Monday, which, of course, makes it longer than it should be. I always make a point of going to bed on the dot at 10 because otherwise I won't go to bed. Right, so just take this upstairs. It's 10 to 10 at the moment, so it's not time yet. There you go, a day in the life of a typical middle-aged bloke living in the Midlands. Ooh, good night, and... Oh, it's good night from him. <laughs>